uh, more options and uh, I'm just gonna start from the top controls so a lot of people are asking about DPI and stuff like that I don't even remember what DPI I have right now probably 800 but yeah I think 800 DPI but this Did is you the leave? most important thing huh did you leave? Yeah, yeah, I'm just gonna do the settings. Um, uh, yeah, I don't know, not guide, but just gonna show people what settings I use, so people can decide for themselves if this is something for them or not. But the way I the way I set my mouse sensitivity, and this is actually very very important. I have several videos about this. Um, if you wanna figure out the best settings for your for your mouse sensitivity um, check out my aim and skill tutorials um, some of those are, are not even related to to battlefield they're older than than battlefield 1 plan 2 h1z1 but the principle is the same and you want to find an empty part of the map and you want to spin around 360 you, you find a fixed target and spin around 360 and you measure or what your mouse sensitivity is and then you adjust accordingly based on that but I explain that more in depth with um, in my aim and guide tutorials raw mouse put on vibration <laughs> well uh, invert vertical look off invert vertical flight on okay yeah, yeah. Uh, need that so the stick sensitivity all of that is probably not so that important, but soldier zoom sensitivity 70%. So I don't even remember these settings because it's such a long time ago. Gamepad, I don't even look at that. A lot of this is probably not related to. I mean, some of this is just with a stick anyway, but yeah, this is what I have. Decouple aiming from turning. That's that's an important thing, especially when you're a gunner. Let's see what else do we have. Um, Gaming still. I don't know it. Sorry. And let me see. Show HUD. Player created content. Show. All right, chat on all of this. See if there's anything here that is important. I don't really know. Um, most of this is probably default. I made a video about crosshair color. You can just search for it if you're looking for that. But yeah, basically you want to have a color that doesn't blend in with the background. That's why I don't have white or green or blue or whatever hit indicator is just personal preference minimap I set it to, uh, yeah these settings I don't even remember which ones I've changed and which ones are default I don't it's I've been playing this game for such a long time I don't even remember all the things anymore but yeah here you got my um, set things anyway. I don't think this is default. I think I've increased this. I think default is 100. I, th I remember changing this. Rotate with the view. I have that on. Opacity thing. Th these things can be very important, actually. So you don't have um, like when you aim and th there's a capture flag behind. You can't see your enemy because of the capture flag stuff like that. Could be good to turn that to objective opacity to twenty. 
when you aim down sight. Probably put that on 50 actually. It's good to have these things because you need to know them. But yeah. Advanced. As low as possible. Auto leaning. I have it off. Perish it auto de deploy. Have that off. That was really annoying for me. Network graph, you could put that on if you. Uh, it, it's probably annoying for people watching the stream and uh, videos, that's why I have it off. And uh, let's see. Full stream borderless, that's only because I'm streaming, because I need two monitors. You probably don't want to have that yourself. Brightness is now 100, it's because I played on a night map, I normally have it like somewhere here. Based on my monitor, vertical student off, these are my field of view. Uh, motion blur off. And... Uh, well, just showing you what I have here. Mesh quality on ultra, that's for um, to be able to see people at long range for f when you fly and whatever. I'm not sure how important that is on Battlefield 1, but it used to be very important in the previous Battlefield titles. Huh. I had anti-aliasing on. I don't know why. <coughs> I put some of these on just for the for the video uh, for making videos. Otherwise, it can look a little bit boring. I would recommend you have everything here on low, and then mesh quality on ultra if you're flying sometimes. Everything else on low, but for the sake of making videos and streaming, I put a little bit of this on. Maybe that's why I had the um, anti-aliasing on also. And uh, is there anything else? Yeah, that's that's it. I hope this was helpful. Um, I'm a little bit unprepared. I didn't really know. Um, didn't really check out all these things uh, for this video because it's 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 a it's an old game, and I've been already I'm already done with my settings. I don't even remember them anymore. <laughs> 